Alex and Felix recipes. I am Felix. Alex right here. So today we made Japanese crepes. Yeah. Okay. Well, what makes them Japanese? I don't really know. They just look like normal crepes to me. Yeah, so here's the thing. I'm told by someone who lived in Japan that this is a popular thing over there, particularly with whipped cream and strawberries. Why? Don't really know. They just tend to like lighter desserts <laughs> over there. This is a popular really sure. thing here too. Uh, yeah, I guess you're not wrong. Yeah. I'm not sure what makes them Japanese, but it's just popular over there. So uh, this is okay. flour, baking soda. Again, uh, all one the, more uh, question before we get kay. into it. In terms of crepes, uh, sweet or savory? What do you prefer? Ooh. Okay, well, first of all, all directions and ingredient amounts are down below, so don't feel like you have to listen to us Yeah, too much. I, I don't think I'm going to let you get yeah, too much uh, into the explanation. I've, I've got a lot of crepe theory that I crepe. have to get okay. out of my system. So. so I would say, ooh, that's tough. I don't know if I've ever had a savory crepe. However, okay. I tend to prefer savory to sweet, so I'm going to go savory crepes. Interesting. Whenever I have like a sweet crepe, like with Nutella or something yeah. like that, I'm always like, eh, it's fine, but like, I could be having a waffle. That, oh, at that point, oh, I might as well yeah. just have, at that point, you're just eating mm. dessert and you can have any dessert you want. I'm not picking crepes. All right, pancakes, waffle, crepes. Oh, waffles. Yeah, waffles. then what? Wa oh. I would have to go waffles, pancakes, and crepes. Int so you don't, oh, French okay. toast is dead last. I oh, know, like yeah. oh so that's in there too. Okay. Yeah. French Actually, toast. I went out for breakfast the other day. It was like breakfast for dinner. Uh, and then, my least, so I, whoever's watching, yeah. well, nobody watches this, but whoever's <laughs> listening right now, I do not like breakfast food. I don't eat eggs. I don't eat pancakes. I don't, I just do not like breakfast food. Like I'll wake up 9am on a Saturday. I'll just make like veal pasta. I do not eat breakfast food. I, breakfast is my favorite food. Actually. Yeah, you is, know what? Lots, lots yeah, of people say that and I'm not about it at no, all. No, do you not, not like eggs or what is it? I don't it? like eggs. It's just the texture, smell, just everything about it. I do not like eggs. That's so weird. I have no right. idea why. Yeah, but we never uh, we never get to eat it because you, you exactly veto it. it. <laughs> you veto I it. I use my veto. Oh, whatever. Uh, in the United Council of going for food, I'm Russian. I just come in. <laughs> not happening. <laughs> well, anyways, but okay. Now you can talk about the video. All right, so back to the video to. now. Okay. We basically, we took all the dry ingredients, whisked them up. We did the eggs, whisked them up, put the milk in, whisked it all together. Pour it in the pan, swirl it around when it's hot. Yeah. Make sure you butter the pan first, otherwise you're never gonna get the crepes those, off. I see lumps in it. What are the are the lumps there on purpose or? Yeah, sure. Or are they like the pancakes where you? <laughs> yeah, I like the pancakes. <laughs> no, was it the waffles or the? Yeah, so you're seeing lumps in like the the runny yeah, batter, right? Yeah. yeah, I mean with the flour, it's never gonna get oh, super yeah. smooth unless you put it in a blender, which I wasn't about to do. Mm. But they all turn out all right once yeah. you do it. So good enough. So we're doing the. But whip I thought the lumps helped. I thought I made them fluffier. I'm not sure how it works for this. You, when you do the pancake batter, you do want a relatively lumpy batter. Mm -hmm. This I just couldn't get smooth. You're probably better off with a smooth batter for the crepes, but it doesn't really matter. Once okay, well, what down. are you making right here? This so this is the whipped cream. I just did it by hand because why dirty oh, a mixer, right? Man, it's so good doing the whipped cream. It by is. Hand. We should just do it like that. Yeah, you, like no, otherwise, I, you gotta take the mixer out. You gotta put it on the counter. We gotta frame yeah. the shot. We gotta like it's just it's so much more work. This is just heavy cream in a bowl. You whisk it up. Yeah. Put in powdered sugar once it gets the uh, soft peaks. Whisk it to stiff peaks, so you're good to go. Why then you, you get something like that. Why put in the sugar first as opposed to waiting until it's Because uh, you want to you want to get it going first mm -hmm. and sort it out. Once if the sugar's already in there, it just yeah. it makes it a bit of a mess. So now that we have the crepe, we can assemble. So we're gonna do the Nutella. Put some whipped cream on it. Put your strawberries or bananas or whatever you like. Oh yeah. Uh, apparently we put pocky in there, which is sort of <laughs> like a like a chocolate covered pretzel type deal. It's like yeah. a snack. Yeah, no, treat, I, I've had it. You've had it. Yeah. And then there you go. So, I mean, pretty straightforward. The hardest part is just getting the crepe flipped in the pan. Oh, you really okay. got to make sure you butter that pan. Otherwise, it's just going to stick. Okay. So, okay. basically, you put your filling on one quarter, fold it in half, and then you kind of roll it around the center point, which I illustrated very well with my hands in the frame. <laughs> you think I'd be better at this by now? After yeah, at least it's in focus. <laughs> yeah, at least it's in focus now. We're filming this much better now. Yeah, I, I like the... Uh... We figured out how to work the camera better. I actually sat down one day and I'm like, all right, this is how I do it. The aspect ratio is different. It's yeah. cool. Way better overall. The colors are way better too. Yeah, that too. Just overall, too. it just looks better. I like it. Yeah, I think we're going to shoot... The thing is, it's a lot more work to shoot it like this, especially when oh. we do different angles and everything like that. But I think it works it. Works it. I think it's worth it. I can't speak. <laughs> no, it's all right. It's all right. What kind of... is it? That's chocolate covered? Yeah, they're like oh. a cookies and cream type deal. Oh, I didn't I know, know they had. I didn't know they had that flavor. Yeah, there's a bunch of different ones. Wow. So anyway, stack them up they like look this. So good. Not bad, right? Man, did you eat? How many did you eat? Uh, I ate two. The thing is, we have extra, right? So I pick at them, obviously. <laughs> so I mean, I only had maybe one of these crepes, but then I picked the stuff and yeah, ate yeah. all the leftovers. Oh, and okay, okay. So yeah, drizzle it with chocolate. Then we're gonna dust it with some powdered sugar. And good to go. Some looks like a Some, lot. And well, 
It's got to show up on camera, right? Yeah, fair enough. Yeah. So that's oh, the thing. We cool. usually overdo it just for the yeah. picture. Oh, you got something so that looks good. like that. Oh, I would have loved to have tried one. Yeah, that's pretty good. We'll make them again. I'll show you. There's yeah. another crepe recipe I'm Will we? Do. You won't veto it? I won't veto it. <laughs> we'll do it. All right. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed it, and we will see you next week. Bye.